carry on and travel outfit wisely. So, you're going to want to wear a jacket on the plane that goes with everything that you brought, which we'll get to. So I chose a denim jacket, which I'll wear with a white tee and some leggings. You're going to add a Panama hat, a scarf, and some espadrilles. Can't see them over there. Um, so these are all key pieces that you're going to use later on your trip. So a takeaway tip for you is don't pack anything that you can't wear in these two different ways. The night before, lay out everything that you plan on bringing and edit everything out that does not follow that rule. You'll end up with much less stuff. So your carry-on bag should be considered your worst case scenario bag. In case your luggage gets lost, stolen, or delayed, all those terrible things that we hope does not happen on any of your vacations, um, you have one sheet day of outfits planned and packed in with you. I like to use a beach bag just so we already have it with us. And then inside it, we're going to roll some wrinkle free items that we're going to use. So, a must have swimsuit so you waste no time. You can get straight to the beach, pull. And it also doubles as a top when it's slipped under a little printed pencil skirt. Also, in that carry on bag, one cute day dress, a must. And a flap that you can dress up or down. I love a gladiator sandal for this. So all that is going to be great in your carry-on. And then you're also going to be wearing your scarf, your hat, your espadrille. So that stuff you can mix in as well. I love a scarf for a vacation because it's so versatile. You can wear it as a shawl. You can wear it as a sarong, as a beach blanket. It's a great piece to bring with you. So now, let's talk about our luggage. You're going to want to bring something that's super light and packable, like this LaPaul luggage, so you're not wasting precious poundage on the luggage itself. Inside it, we're going to put some accessories. Let's start here. So you already have two great shoes with you in your carry-on bag. So let's add an evening sandal. And you have your beach bag, so let's add a little cute little backpack for video shopping, maybe and then some little evening clutches. I brought a solid one as well because we have a lot of prints going on back here. For jewelry, do not waste time on teeny tiny little pieces. Pack bold statement pieces that are really going to transform your outfit. So statement necklaces, always good for this. But for really hot, humid vacation climates, I love a big dramatic earring. You can slip back your hair, throw on an earring, and you're ready to go out. Clothing. I usually recommend a little white dress or a little black dress, but since this is vacation and we're here to have fun, a little white printed dress is awesome. So, two different ways that we could wear this is with our statement sandals and our little clutch. This works because all of these colors are the same. Or, dress it down with a gladiator sandal and a little backpack. That's for something where you want to be polished but still casual. Um, maybe like one. So down to the nitty gritty, we have four bottoms and four tops that are going to mix and match in a bunch of different ways. So let's start with our printed <coughs> One way we could wear this is with this little cute little printed top for a twosy look that's super trendy right now. We're going to wear both of these with our little <coughs> statement heel or with a little black crop top to show some skin. So since this is kind of print heavy, we're going to choose our solid accessories for this and maybe a little earring for some sparkle. Our second bottom are these great flowy pants. You're going to see these everywhere right now. And they're perfect for vacation because they're super airy and light. And I like a high-waisted variety that you'll wear with a little crop top. Cuff them with some gladiator sandals and add your Panama hat, maybe for some sightseeing. Like that. And then you could also dress it up with a little lace top tucked in and some heels. Our third bottom is this nice clean white skirt short. This actually goes with all of our tops, but two of my favorite ways to wear it is with this little varsity tape. Here with your escadrille sandals and a Panama hat, maybe for some souvenir shopping. Or this first shirt is actually a two-in-one in and of itself. It flips over for a solid color, so you wear the solid side with this and some sandals for an easy running around outfit. And finally, we have a little cover-up short that we'll wear with a white bikini. And this 
also goes with a bunch of our other talks. Speaking of cover-ups, I also would like to bring a kimono style robe with me, a kimono style cover-up with me that you can also wear as a robe for lounging around time. And since this is a sexy vacation, you're going to want to bring some lingerie. <laughs> And my tip here is to bring something that's also comfy. So a romper, a silky romper is really good for this. And you can slip it on under your robe and you can have a cute little outfit. Finally, with all this great stuff, you're going to want to choose a great versatile watch. I love the Citizen Echo Drive Axiom watch for this. It's casual enough for everyday looks, but sleek enough for nighttime and evening looks. Here's to a stress-free, perfectly 